Well, in my case, you know, really not much more than a handful of nickels and dimes. Let me take a look here at my channel dashboard. Um, so I started monetizing uh, the channel, I think it was early 2019. So here's the last 28 days, and all these are way down. In fact, they've been trending way down for the last you know, four to five months. And I attribute a lot of that to just people returning to work. Um, you know, uh, COVID hopefully starting to run its course. But if I... Uh, if I go to Lifetime, um, here I am uh, at $438.27. If you divide that into, what, like 30-plus months, it's really it's really nothing at all. I started, I think, what, right around here or so, February of 19? Yeah, so, and this here is, you know, really during COVID, the 12 months or so, when people were staying at home for the most part, a lot of time on their hands, and then here we go, the summer months, and then here we are today. So that's what I'm, uh, that's what I'm pulling in. Now, if you want to know more about what people are making on YouTube or any social media platform for that matter, you can go to a, a website called uh, socialblade.com, and here it is, and here's my channel on Social Blade, and, you know, it's, it's quite a range they give you here. Like it says, my estimated monthly earnings are $1 to $22, and my annual earnings are $16 to $261, so, um, you know, it's certainly, uh, there's a lot of margin of error here, but... You get a sense of what some people are pulling in. I mean, there are definitely people out there making bank on social media. Um, yeah, so here's my last video, Muradin. So I'm, <laughs> I, I talked about this with uh, with somebody that um, it might be a very boring winter for me on my channel this year. Maybe that's why the views are down. But you know, my my Muradin tactical wallet, which by the way is after I've got it all set up, it's not that much. Uh, <laughs> it's really not that much more compact than my other regular wallet. But certainly, I like the I do like the RFID blocking component to that. So whatever, uh, moving on. Um, but yeah, so Social Blade will, will tell you kind of what people are making and give you a sense of what they're doing on their, their, their social media platforms. I mean, I only have YouTube, but there's like, you know, Instagram and Twitch, you got Facebook, people are making money all over the place nowadays on online. So anyway, um, there's that. And then going back to the dashboard here, interesting that some, you know, what my popular videos are. Let me see if I go to Let's see, back to the analytics. I don't understand why I have this one video if I do like the last, say, year here, last 365. Scroll down. So card case conundrum um, is always at the top of the list. And I don't know why. I guess it just gets pushed out more than the other videos. But for the last 365 days, these are what have been my most popular videos on the channel. This one was it's already a few years old, this one. I remember doing this one. I guess I just, you know, was the right place at the right time this one really kind of blew up you know for my standards anyway when i put this one out all i did was talk about i think five or so cards of mine that have uh you know that dropped dramatically in value in a short period of time so a little bit hyperbolic with the with the title and the the image there but drew a lot of attention to say the least at least for me anyway um comic books etc top loaders so again storage videos are popular um mickey man also yeah there's that um and going back to the dashboard, somewhat of a, uh, oh, uh, you know, coming up, I'll tell you about this if we go over here. So here's a post on my community page or whatever. Maybe you saw this, maybe you didn't. But I did a collaborative video for the first time. Silver Jackify and I, we got together and we did a, a collection, Smackdown, Throwdown, Top 40 versus Top 40. It was really fun to do. In fact, I'm surprised how long it ran. We, it was like over an hour. And we were hoping we could, you know, record it and then set it up as a premiere and then have a chat room session that kind of like goes along with the video. But apparently when you stream yard privately, um, all you could really do is just release the video and then that's it. No chat room goes with it. At least we don't think so. So unfortunately, it's just going to be a, you know, a video he's going to uh, put it on his channel and uh, upload it or, or, or I guess reveal it tomorrow night around nine o'clock, he said. But it was a fun video, showed a lot of cards, obviously, talked about cards, you know, stories here or there. Um, so uh, make sure you check that out. Um, that's tomorrow night around 9 o'clock or so. He and I did that, and, uh, yeah, it was, it was it was cool. So um, that's it. So, you know, very transparent. In case you were wondering, you know, how much people make on YouTube, um, here's my here's my bankroll. And then if you want to go to Social Blade, you could uh, check out other people's stuff and get a sense of what they're doing, if that sort of thing interests you. And, uh, yeah, so just FYI. And uh, talk to you later.